about Salemore? Everything. I think Salemore is a fantastic place. I think Salemore's great because of the people here. People support each other and muck in to make it an even better community. It is independent from Sale. It has a good community spirit. It's got a wonderful urban village feel to it. Nice people, nice shops. What can I say? A great sense of community. Everybody pulls together when something needs doing. The best thing about Salemore is independence. It's an urban village and with that comes independent businesses. And, and that's lovely when you've got children to teach them the value of money and to go to the shopkeepers and he knows who they are. Um, and what they do and has a personal relationship with them, I find a really lovely thing. And I've been here, the shop for business has been here for eight years and I meet, obviously, and made a lot of friends, like to people around here. And it's a little, nice little village, it's really nice. I've got a letter upstairs, which is a letter from a lady with two pounds in it, and she thanked me very much when she was, she, she didn't have enough money for her purchases, and she sent the two pounds with a lovely letter and that's what Salemore is all about, community. You know, from time to time we will group ourselves and make some fun things for kids and for adults. I think it will help us more closer. With a young family you can bring them up and you can bring them into the green grocers. The shopkeepers are really helpful and really friendly so it's fantastic with a young family here. This is a picture from 1903 where the meat is, is hung outside. At that time it was owned by my great uncle who was known as David Albany Greenhalgh, who was known as Tosh, because he liked Macintosh sweets. Diversity is the big word about Selmore. It brings diversity to town, and you need diversity. We like it. We've been here since uh, 78. I think it's really important to the local community that it's kept independent and I think it's um, an important part of our culture. I think like, for me traffic's really important because having young kids here it's really important that they're safe, they can cycle around here, they can go on the scooters, so actually we need to improve traffic. It's, it is an issue at the moment, the, the cars travel far too quick through the village, it's really congested at times, it's really important we make some improvements to the, to the pavements and to the traffic flow through the village. You could have eateries around it are possibly, you know, little continental like cafes and such like, you know, I'd, I'd like this place. It would be really nice to have a little bit more nightlife around here, some nice maybe wine bars um, and, and other restaurants and places for people to come to actually bring people in in the evening. The spaces need to be tidied up, we need to get some flower bins around the place. We've got an awful lot of railings in the village which are crying out for some plants on them. We've got urban green spaces that could be better maintained. It's very rare you get a village like Salemore um, and they're getting rarer and rarer. The sooner this place is looked after or even put on a map somewhere the better it is for us.